Well, the only question I got is um, how are we going to determine just how much more tax dollars is collected per up and make sure we get it? And the reason why I asked this question is, uh, to my knowledge, the, the state doesn't really break it down to what town uh, each town brings in. Mr. Chair, I think you're right. I think the, um, the point of concern, if you were at the county commissioner's meeting when this occurred, it was mentioned that they would look at all the money and determine where it could be used best. And if you remember, I went forward that day and said, that comment gives me pause um, and great concern because the allocation of the increase in sales taxes, um, theoretically, hopefully, uh, is based on population. And our allocation off the top of my head is probably 44 um, percent based on our population. So that is the reason why we want this proposal in front of the county because we want to ensure that um, they don't look at the total pot and then think maybe the money should go to Gabs or Tonopah or Beatty. I mean we have a very large population here. We're the largest in Nye County and I've taken the opportunity in the past few months to tell you about the responses that the fire department, where when we register 600, 700, whatever responses, you can see that we have a need for a fire department and we have a need for, to be fully staffed for the safety of our residents. So. Right, another thing I forgot is new car sales. That's a, a lot of sales tax. That's. Way back when, when I first moved here, Nevada was, I mean, excuse me, Pahrump was an importer of sales tax. What that meant was is, uh, we, we send our sales tax to Carson City, but we actually got more back. We had a fixed rate that we got. But once the car lots came into Pahrump, then we were generating more sales tax and than what that was, and we wanted our fair share, and then, you know, that was changed. But we never really got our fair share. So I just want to, I mean, uh, you know, we're just sitting here now discussing this stuff, but I, I want to feel confident, uh, and I, I do, I just want to hear it again that you uh, you've done your homework and you feel that, you know, this is going to represent our fair share, which you think it should be. This is a proposal that we're submitting to the county. It is not meant to be written in stone. Uh, the monies are to come back to us and let us determine how we need to use them. This is merely giving the county an idea of how we would use them. It's not a, a promise that we're going to use them this way, but we do want them to see the need, and I would, I would hate to wait too long, Mr. Chair, is what I'm trying to say. Yeah, it's, it's uh, and I agree. I think we don't want to get bent over by the county to begin with, um, but I think the legislation was quite clear that the money will be distributed on population, and they listed our population in the last go around at 83.65 percent of the county, which would have would would give us, on their estimations, if I remember the figures right, about 1.2, 1.3 million dollars 